Okay, so for those of you who do not know, this game is called Soul Frame. Soul Frame is being developed by the same people who brought you Warframe, uh, a very successful looter shooter. Um, so they are taking a gamble on a new game which has been described as a souls-like game and they just showed it off so we're gonna we're gonna watch this okay watch it let's give our first impression i have not seen anything of this game at all okay let's see i'm gonna be forwarding some of the gameplay experience uh because it is a 17 minute video that night Okay, bird. Come on, bird. Come on, drop some dookies. Not by Nog, but hard. But hard. A rally drum. Okay. Come on, fog. Come on, illumination. Yeah. They almost killed the bird. Okay, um. So. I guess this is the beginning of the game, yeah? I like the sound. I like the. Voice acting. Put some clothes on, woman. Okay, graphics seem a little... Eh. What the fuck is wrong with her face? Well, I remember her face. Tone. Okay, dude, I feel like this is a like an Xbox 360 graphics so like far. Amber rocks. A wealth of warmth and of her locks. You know, okay. Okay, I like the way they're presenting the character customization. Not bad. Shade. Like night lock. I wonder if this will have any implications on the decisions of the game or is it just strictly cosmetics because the menu the menu is a little bit of interesting of spotted dough. the ui for this character Last customization you. yeah I know. not many Last options either you, so. yeah But I, I'm not a, I'm not against it, you know? That's not gonna make or break the game for me. Ew. She gave birth to a little clay monster. Dude, she looked 50. Why is she still having children? So, that was a sneak peek at War Song Prologue. Okay. Uh, as I mentioned, it's the intro quest, and what you saw there is how you. I guess this is the, the baby, first customization right? template of your character. There will be more for that to come, so you can customize further. Okay, um, there will be more customization now, so, uh, further, Chad. We have a showcase on how you can get the next ancestor. Okay, not bad so far. Okay, this doesn't look too bad. Oh. Um, the knife fold. So, uh, what's really cool if you're in I don't really like that. Maybe, maybe it's just because of the demo. But I feel like when you're turning, you're panning your camera, the frame skip or something. The knife fold. This right so, here. Uh, what the really hell is cool that panning? Is you can it's go probably here just anytime. demo, right? Like just because of the demo. Orbiter at uh, the snap of a finger. 
So you can go in here, you can talk to your ancestors, work on your meta, cue crafting, look at the lore you just unlocked, change your weapons. As long as there's no aggro enemies in the vicinity, FPS. at any time you can go into the Nightfold. And as you collect your ancestors, it's kind of like building a village uh, okay. within this kind of purgatory plane. Yeah, you can rock over to the other. You can maybe show them the blacksmith. Um, and then just run on into the tent. How far along is this game? Does anybody know? Like, is this early? Or is this game pretty far along? Holy titties! Wait, dude, her titties are out there. Bro. You can hear all the different musical cues here that we've been working on as well. Each ancestor has their own. Okay. Um, that's cool, a win for me. Of, uh, Side boobs. instrumentation used and suits their personalities. Same with the voices, custom voices and all of that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so this is our crafting interface. Um, basically, the game's sort of graphics up, find little fragments and these any, little uh, menus uh, don't look that good. I'm going to skip it a little bit, chat. To I'm going to skip a little bit. <laughs> And I, I like the Joe's reflections go... of the water here with the clouds. This is very artistically, very beautiful. Gear up, but you can't ignore the poor dog. Like the art is pretty good. Um, most important feature. <laughs> good night, Mr. Skolin. Oh, wait, they're cheering about petting a fucking wolf? Gear up, but you can't ignore the poor dog on your way. Um, most important feature. <laughs> Paid audience, no shot. <laughs> this is the most important feature. And then, it's yeah, okay. Joe will give us a sneak peek at our arsenal that we'll have probably better for and they just swap out some gear and maybe a little cosmetic change. Okay, okay. Let's take a look. Uh okay. Um The we menu didn't look too complicated, so that was pretty good. And then you get to go back to the to the real world. So that other dimension that you went to is like your safe haven that you can only enter if you're not being attacked at the current state. So you can go back there and I guess you can enhance and everything back up there. Oh, I love the snap. Hello, once human. I love a good snap. Um... I appreciate the fog and stuff, but the graphics so far, at least, from this video that is a really low quality, not impressive. But it is, it is, I'm watching it in very low quality off of YouTube, so it could look a lot better. Okay, combat chat, combat. Ooh, ooh, that movement. Ooh, 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 what is that? No, dude, that movement looks disgusting. What that, what is that roll? What is him half gliding on this fucking slope? You see that roll? What is that? Look at that half gliding. Oh, oh hell no. This better be super early because this does not look good. This does not look good right now. This looks super early build. Okay, come on, Lala. Come on, rat. Oh, you don't trust the rat. That's why you don't trust the rat. Wait, the rat grew, chat. Did you see that? The rat bit him and the rat grew. It looks like it at least. Okay. 
Okay, presentation, a boss fight. Okay. A bow. Can we get somebody who knows how to play the game? This guy accidentally hit the crouch button and he stayed crouching the whole time. Can we get somebody who actually knows how to play a game to test these things? Like, why is he still crouching? When it was gather, no Oh, he he went into stealth. The okay. They won't notice the dookie. Um, I like, so far in this demo, the guided experience does seem pretty nice though. Like you go into that thing, there's this like rat here, and then you introduce into like a boss fight, which sound design on that boss fight is pretty good. The particle effects look really nice. The combat looks like dookie. I'm not gonna lie, this combat does look really bad. It feels like they're trying to attempt like an Elden Ring, a Souls game experience, but failing really bad at it. Or failing at it. See, like, I like these moments right here. That, pretty good. Audio design, really nice. Illumination, pretty good. The lightning right there. They should turn off camera shake for this shit, because this camera shake is going to make me throw up. What the hell was that? That just looks... That looks really early. This looks like an early build of combat. When the character was getting hit, how it glitched out. I do like the snap though. I'm a sucker for a good snap. though i'm kind of immersed chat this the audio does a lot for a game for me and the audio is really good here <laughs> ocarina of time dude this copy paste ocarina of time Okay. You 
Ah! I would have smelt your aura from here, were my sights not drowned in brine. <laughs> I am the witch Verminia. Enchanté. That's nice. You sent us some color. That's and actually really nice. Some taste, besides. That is French, I know. No, that was German accent. Dude, can this guy get alive, dude? Okay, that was beautiful. Okay, now he can fight him. There's no lightning chat. So this guy becomes easier now with a no lightning. I, oh, dude, this, this camera, this shaking shit. What the fuck was that? Dude, the combat looks so trashy. This combat, they need to go, they need to redo it. Start all over. The combat just not it, dude. Look at that, what the? Camera shake off, please. Ooh, blowjob. Okay. Okay, so if you're not so engaged again in combat, you can come you can come back over here. Uh, where she will provide another progression path. Hmm. Hardly better. How am I Oh, he unlocked her and now he could have her at his house. My in this I like this better. NPC. I like this NPC for now. But if I have to fucking listen to this accent all the fucking time, I know not. It's yes. probably gonna drive me insane. The envoy brings us a new button. It's cute right now. So this is a final implementation. But, but yeah, we just wanted to give you guys an impression of the kind of customization you'll be able to do. Sure. We could just eat you up. She does sound cute though. Ooh, dude, there's pubic hair right here. Hot. Showing. I'm playing this game just because of this. Uh, now no, this next one, I don't think anyone would purposely do it, but we were just curious what would happen if a certain D employee played Soul Frame. We wanted to see how Verminia might feel about that. Ugh. Ew. Okay. So, I think I've seen all of it now. Let's take a look at this. They squeak of red moaning in the coral glen of saccharine odor that wafted from his den. His bell tolls. Its echoes taste faintly of black, of torn parts, of claw marks, of drip, drip, drip. lord okay chat so my impression of this trailer honestly i kind of like it i like it i think it's very good you could tell the developers are putting time into it and it looks really good my major complaint and i think it's a, a big one just by watching it alone it feels like the combat is not ready it looks super jank and not in the way where elden ring and like a Dark Souls game look jank, but like it looks like it tried to mimic their jank, but made it even more janky. So like there's a level of jank that I think is acceptable 
and that to me looks a little too early it it just the combat itself looks early build it looks like it could have a little bit more work to it uh, but everything else looks really nice though like the audio design the presentation how the menus look i don't think i mind it graphics i can't be too critical about it because i feel like i'm watching some 720p shit but i think if i was watching it or playing it with better graphics we'll have it would look good yeah so i'm i'm, I'm not disappointed i'm not disappointed the combat um hopefully uh looks better or plays better or plays good yeah it looks really nice though yeah 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 um I, I'm, I'm actually waiting for this uh it's got me hyped i've never seen this game i don't, I don't know so let's see chat when does this game come out when does the game come out um it needs a little polish and fine tuning but looks i they really 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 need to focus on making the combat better the combat needs more work in my opinion combat's a little clunky up close combat has the jank and dna of warframe 2 floating in quotations screen shake and recoil animations ain't uh, aren't enough to make me believe the weight behind the strikes please more on the combat it's so flashy like i had to close my eyes the whole time uh it looks rough looks okay from a distance but you take the real look at it and it's very unpolished um can someone explain if this is same game to warframe um game looks cool here for it combat needs some milk <laughs> the combat needs some milk the combat looks so clunky okay so i'm not the only one that thinks that the combat looked like poop so before i saw this my opinion of soul frame just so you guys know going into it is that the combat was less than impressive the game looked fine and the visuals were decent but the gameplay looked to be uh weak not bad but just weak so that, that's that's how i'm going into it with a parrot Okay, let's see what he says after the first combat chat. A full adult gotcha. You just watched a peak, Ellie. So let's see some combat here. Combat! Here we go! This is awful. He literally said the same thing I said, bro. Oh my lord. It only took me to this scene as well within the first three seconds that this was just not it, dude. They need to fix this. This is so bad. If this game releases this way, it will fail and you'll waste all of your money. They should immediately stop thinking about the UI, stop thinking about petting dogs, fix your- Pre-watched- fucking combat before you kill yeah. this game before it even comes out yeah what were you thinking damn why cook. would you even show this this is terrible you saw three attacks exactly show me three attacks in the ring they're like that oh that's right you can't <laughs> or lies of p or any of these other soul isolation games no it's it's this is terrible and, and he hasn't even seen the worst yet watch with the movement chat with the rolling that rolling and the way it moves around in the terrain it's that same sorry chat but it's like that same shit that you see in warframe i don't fuck with warframe's movement i just don't like it i don't like the way it looks that right there that roll and that movement right there that shit just looks nasty jesus christ man <laughs> that's it chat that's we need to get back before we get banned on the first descendant hey youtube 
Yeah, you. YouTube, you know that the success of this channel relies heavily on you. Viewers like you. By hitting the comment, like, and subscription button, you help me really, 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 really a bunch. More than you ever know. You could even put it on mute and walk away, you know, or lower the volume and walk away. But all the success of this channel relies on you. And I'm very thankful if you hit that comment, like, and subscription button. Also, follow my social medias. Twitter. My Twitter, I put out new art, new stuff. If you want to see more of this... Follow me everywhere, Twitch everywhere, everywhere. I give you my permission, my consent. Go, go. Now, um, hit the follow, comment, like, subscribe, Twitter, Twitch, everything. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching.